Now, this uh, expansion of space-time has uh, an important consequence. It leads to so-called cosmological redshift. To be distinguished from the redshift uh, caused by the Doppler effect or a gravitational redshift when the light is trying to escape from a massive body. So this, there are three types of, of uh, redshift. So let me explain that. Again, going back to our two-dimensional universe, um, the surface of the sphere, we have an expanding, in this case here, uh, two-dimensional universe. And say we have a wave of certain wavelength here, when the universe is this big. As the space stretches, the wave itself will be stretched. Okay? So what has happened is the same wave, but as a result of the expansion of space, its wavelength, that is the distance from one crest to another, has increased. And this type of redshift is what we call cosmological uh, uh, redshift. So once again, there are three types of uh, uh, redshifts, three different causes. One could be because uh, uh, the space is not expanding, but the source is, uh, of light uh, is moving away from us. Uh, the second type of redshift is uh, resulting when uh, light, the photons, are trying to escape the gravitational attraction of the body. To do that, they are losing energy, and as they lose energy, their wavelength increases. So that's called the gravitational redshift. And the third type of redshift is cosmological redshift, which results from the expansion of space. Okay? And uh, the redshift in spectra of the galaxies that is observed uh, is actually of this nature. It's cosmological redshift. So although uh, Slipher initially interpreted the data assuming that it is the, uh, that the redshift results from the Doppler shift, right? Uh, Hubble showed that no, 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 what is happening actually is the space itself is expanding and that is causing the redshift. So it's a cosmological redshift. Turns out that the formula for the amount of redshift and the rate of the expansion of space is basically similar uh, or the same in, in these cases.